Hey guys, welcome back to another video. In this video, I'm going to talk about how to fix Arc Survival Evolver is having an issue with Battle Eye Launcher Error, failed to start Battle Eye service on a PC, and how we can fix this app. So, let me directly get into a step. So, step one is all about we need to try different launch options. That is, option no Battle Eye or Direct X tab. So, this is what we have to try. So for this, we just need to launch the game. Now we have these options. So we have many options over here, but we need to launch the game either with play arc, no battle eye and cheat. That is what we have to try or we have to launch with direct X tab. Either any one of these things should be launched. That is what we have to try. Now, if that is not working, we have to move to the next step. Next step is all about we need to set beta participation to a ASE that is pre aquatica or none. For this, we just need to go over here, right click and go to the properties, go to betas. Now, from here, the beta participation is none. So, either we have to change into pre aquatica ASC. If it is none, change into pre aquatica ASC. If that is not the case, you can change it. If it is on the pre aquatica ASC, then you have to change it to none. Then you have to check with the game. Still, if you are having the trouble, then you can move to the next one. If you have in enabled any modes or installed any modes, just uninstall the mode and unsubscribe the modes. That is what we have to try. Next one, we need to uninstall and reinstall the battle eye. So to do this, just go over here, right click on the game, go to manage, browse local file. Now from here, navigate to engine. Now from here, we have to go to binaries, not sorry, this one, we have to go to shooter game. Binaries, Win64, Battle Eye. Go to Uninstall Battle Eye. That is right click and go to Run as Administrator and go for Yes. Now the Battle Eye is uninstalled. Now we need to reinstall it back. So select this one, right click and go for Run as Administrator and go for Yes. Now the Battle Eye is installed it back. Now we have to move to the next one. That is all about. We need to uninstall the Battle Eye. Then we need to launch the game. During the launch, it will install the Battle Eye. So to do this, just go over here. That is, go to the game, right click on the battle eye. Now we need to go over here and as administrator and go for yes. So the battle eye is uninstalled. Now in order to install it back, all we have to do is just launch the game from here. So the battle eye will be reinstalled back, right? You don't have to do anything, just launch the game. Next one is all about, we need to verify, add the game exe to the window security. So just go over here search for the control panel and we need to click on the control panel now from here go to windows defender firewall go to allow an app or feature through windows defender firewall now from here we need to add the game as you can see the arc survival evolved is already added that i have put a check on both the boxes private and public and also similarly just click on the change setting go to allow another app go to the browse navigate to this pc go to local disk d steam library steam apps common Go to Arc, get into the shooter game, binaries, win64. We need to add, I have already added this one, launcher is added. Similarly, I have to add it, shooter game BE, that should be also be added. Now I need to add it. Then also I have to add it, battle eye. Battle eye should also be added. That is, B service x64 should also be added. Now once the B is added, then you have to put a check on both the boxes, private and public. Now we need to close this and we have to launch the game. Next one is we need to verify the game file. So just go over here, right click on the game, go to properties, go to installed file and verify the game file and we have to launch the game. Similarly, the last and the list of that I'm going to ask is run the game as an administrator. Make sure it is in the compatibility mode. So right click over here, go to properties, installed file and just click on the browse. Now get into the shooter game, binaries, win64, sorry, not this one. Yes, config, sorry, not this one, engine, binaries, sorry, shooter game, binaries, win64. Now from here, if you scroll down, you can see this is the launcher. So right click and go to show more options, properties, compatibility, put a check on run this program in the compatibility mode. And also you have to put a check on disable full screen optimization. And also you have to put a check on run this program as an administrator, go for OK. Now we have to close this and you have to check with the game. So these are the steps when it comes to how to fix this. 
and i hope this quick video is helpful and if you find this video helpful don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notification that's it bye bye